Okay, I'm doing going to do a little comparison test between my GoPro Hero 8 Black and which is the camera right here on the left and my DJ Pocket 2, DJI Pocket 2. Look how good it looks through the screen, see? In low light, this is way better than the Hero 8 Black and we will walk around and, and I will show everybody why. I'm going to hold this and right beside the uh, my DJI I pocket two right beside my Hero 8 Black and try to do a fair comparison. I'm shooting 4K 30 frames per second in both. On my GoPro, it's 4K 30 frames per second. Uh, my frame uh, frames per second on the GoPro Hero 8 Black is 30. I'm shooting also 4K 30 frames per second on my DJI Pocket 2. Uh, on the GoPro, I never shoot above 800 ISO max because when it's low light like this, if you was to turn the GoPro Hero 8 Black up to uh, 1600 or 3200, the footage will be too drainy, unusable. But <clears throat> in this video, you will be able to see why the DJI is way better. And I can already see through the lens of both cameras why the DJI Pocket 2 smokes the GoPro Hero 8 Black. In daytime, they're they're both really comparable, but because the DJ, I mean because the Hero 8 Black, GoPro Hero 8 Black has electronic stabilization, it gets crappy one hour before dark. With the DJI uh, Pocket 2, you can continue to shoot in low light footage, in low light conditions, and because the the DJI Osmos 2 has a set that the camera's right here on the front of it, but it has a gimbal that holds the lens on top of the camera. The camera head, there's electronic, uh, a mechanical gimbal, gimbal. It moves when you're walking, so it's not electronic. The gimbal's the way to go. So this is a comparison. And I'm gonna to try to hold both cameras still as possible and take my reading glasses off because they will interfere with my footage if I don't get in me seeing so bear with me as you can see there's a train right here lit up and if you move the Hero 8 Black probably a little too fast because it's electronic stabilization it will, it will look crappy but I love my GoPro Hero 8 Black I'm not knocking it in the daytime both the cameras are both the cameras the Hero 8 Black and the DJ I Pocket 2 are great cameras but one thing I can say, the GoPro cameras, especially the light from the Hero 5 Black up, especially the Hero 7 Black and the Hero 8 Black and the Hero 9 Black, the colors are oversaturated. They have too much color in them. Where the DJI Pocket 2 is, what you see out of the DJI Pocket 2 is looks is completely natural. The colors are natural. They're not they're not, they're not oversaturated with the DJI Pocket 2. So, but I do still love the Hero 8 Black, even though, like I said in the daytime, the colors are a little bit oversaturated. But it's a great camera, I can't knock it. It can do things the DJI Pocket 2 cannot do. The, D, the DJI Pocket 2 can zoom in. The engine on the train is going backwards. And let's walk around. This is the back of the, <clears throat> the old uh, train depot, which is now a bank, Citizens Bank. Let me turn both cameras around on my face. It's pretty dark back here. And let's see what kind of footage we can get out of both cameras. How does it look, the Hero 8 Black on my left? How does the DJI Pocket 2 look? Which one looks the best? All right, well, let's continue to walk around. Let's get our footage. I can guarantee you the Hero 8 Black is probably already getting more than likely, likely jerky. Like I said, the electronic stabilization on the, <clears throat> the Hero 8 Black is good in the daytime, but close to dark. 
it used to get so jerky I don't like to use the camera period and I'm not going to be able to film long with my here eight black because I'm only using a 32 gigabyte card and it's almost full because I took my I use SanDisk uh, 4k video cards you know the most expensive ones you can buy even the 32 is the most expensive one you can buy the 32 gigabyte which is in the here eight black I took my 128 gigabyte SanDisk Extreme 4k card and I put it in my DJI pocket too so I can't record as long on the 32 as a which is in the Hero 8 Black, it, Hero 8 Black than I can in the pocket <clears throat> too, cause it's got a bigger card in it. Pointing towards the light, which one does the best? The Hero 8 Black or the DJI Pocket 2. Both of them shooting 4K, 30 frames per second. This, like I said, this is the Citizens Bank. We will see which camera does the best. Now I don't know if I'll be able to put the cam a camera footage exactly side by side when I play the videos back on YouTube because the software I was using, which I paid for, started ha started being real buggy. So now I'm just using my uh, Windows 10 video editor, which does a great job. The only thing is, you can only use 30 frames per second. So what I will do is I will will render both of these cameras and I will take up the 4K30 from both cameras.